For years, Russia has proudly presented hypersonic missiles as its ultimate strategic weapon. Moscow claimed it possessed missiles so fast, so advanced, that no air defense system on Earth could stop them. According to the Kremlin, these weapons could strike targets thousands of kilometers away, even reaching the United States itself. This claim wasn't just military boasting, it was a form of intimidation. Hypersonic missiles travel at such extreme speeds that modern air defenses simply cannot respond in time. Russia used this capability to project power and suggest technological dominance over its rivals. But strategic imbalances never last forever. Now, the United States has responded, and the shockwaves are being felt in Moscow. Washington has unveiled a hypersonic weapon of its own, one capable of reaching the Russian capital in minutes. Russia's most powerful strategic card has finally been challenged. And the weapon behind this shift has a name, Dark Eagle. The Redstone Arsenal Reveal On December 15th, according to Militarni, U.S. Secretary of Defense Pete Hegseth visited Redstone Arsenal in Alabama, which now serves as the headquarters of U.S. Space Command. This was not a ceremonial visit. During a guided tour of U.S. Army missile systems, the Pentagon quietly confirmed a major milestone. America's long-awaited hypersonic weapon is no longer experimental. Dark Eagle has been completed, and it has entered production. Lieutenant General Francisco Lozano, who oversees hypersonic and rapid acquisition programs, made it clear that the missile on display was not a prototype. It was a finished, deployable system. Even more significant was the production timeline. Dark Eagle is currently being built at a rate of one missile per month, with plans to increase that to two per month. That equals between 12 and 24 hypersonic missiles per year. For a country that fell behind Russia and China in hypersonic development, this marks a crucial turning point. Why Dark Eagle Exists Dark Eagle is not designed for symbolic destruction or terror strikes. Its purpose is strategic. The missile is meant to target air defense systems, radar installations, sensor arrays, and command and control nodes, the backbone of modern military operations. Hypersonic missiles are almost impossible to intercept, and that makes Dark Eagle an ideal path-clearing weapon. It can punch through defenses and open corridors for follow-up attacks using conventional missiles or aircraft. Dark Eagle is trailer-launched and travels at speeds exceeding Mach 5, but speed alone isn't what makes it dangerous. Like other hypersonic weapons, it combines extreme velocity with erratic maneuvering inside the atmosphere. This combination makes tracking incredibly difficult and interception nearly impossible. By the time defense is detected, the missile is already seconds away from impact. Range and Global Implications One of the most important revelations about Dark Eagle is its range. According to General Lozano, the missile can travel up to 3,500 kilometers, or roughly 2,175 miles. That distance is enough to place Moscow within reach, depending on launch location. Lozano even suggested that a launch from London could theoretically strike the Russian capital. That single statement carries enormous implications. From Guam, Dark Eagle could threaten China. From Qatar, it could reach Iran. The United States maintains hundreds of military bases across dozens of countries. These bases exist specifically to project power globally. With that infrastructure already in place, Dark Eagle could become part of a worldwide hypersonic network. What makes this even more interesting is that earlier reports listed Dark Eagle's range at around 2,775 miles. The updated figure suggests either major technical improvements or intentional understatement during earlier development phases. Either way, the missile appears far more capable than originally acknowledged. Warhead and Kinetic Force Dark Eagle's warhead has sparked debate. It reportedly weighs less than 30 pounds, far smaller than traditional cruise missile warheads. A Tomahawk missile, for example, carries more than 30 times that explosive weight. But Dark Eagle doesn't rely on explosive force alone. At hypersonic speeds, kinetic energy becomes the primary weapon, 
The missile's impact delivers a devastating blow capable of damaging a wide area, potentially comparable to a large military facility. U.S. officials have also hinted at alternative warhead options, including blast fragmentation payloads designed to disable radar systems and air defense batteries. In other words, Dark Eagle isn't built to flatten cities, it's built to blind, disrupt, and cripple critical military infrastructure. Speed Analysis Dark Eagle can reportedly cover its full range in about 20 minutes. That translates to roughly 108 miles per minute, or approximately Mach 8.5, more than three times faster than the minimum requirement for hypersonic classification. At that speed, reaction time is virtually non-existent. From detection to impact, defenders have only minutes, sometimes seconds, to respond. For most air defense systems, that simply isn't enough. Speed is what makes hypersonic weapons fundamentally different from anything that came before them. Testing and Deployment Dark Eagle is no longer theoretical. In 2024, the U.S. Army and Navy conducted successful end-to-end -end flight tests. One launch took place from Hawaii, crossing the Pacific Ocean. Another was conducted from Cape Canaveral over the Atlantic. These tests confirmed that Dark Eagle had moved from development into early operational readiness. Deployment discussions are already underway. While no official announcement has been made, reports suggest that Europe, possibly Germany, could host Dark Eagle batteries within the next few years. If that happens, it would represent a direct response to Russia's hypersonic deployments. Russia and China Context Russia is the reason Dark Eagle exists. Moscow has already used hypersonic missiles like the Kinzhal missile in Ukraine, where they have proven extremely difficult to intercept. China, too, invested heavily in hypersonic technology years before the United States, unveiling its Dongfeng systems as early as 2019. U.S. military leaders openly admit they allowed rivals to pull ahead. In 2023, senior commanders warned Congress that hypersonic weapons represent one of the most dangerous gaps in America's defensive posture. Dark Eagle doesn't erase that gap, but it begins to close it. Limitations and Doubts Dark Eagle is not without weaknesses. Russia's Kinzhal missile carries a far heavier warhead and is believed to be nuclear-capable. In raw destructive power, Moscow still holds an advantage. U.S. testing agencies have also acknowledged uncertainty regarding Dark Eagle's lethality. Limited test data make it difficult to fully assess its real-world effectiveness. The Pentagon itself has admitted that more operational data is needed. In short, Dark Eagle's true power remains unproven. So what does Dark Eagle really mean? It means the United States has finally entered the hypersonic race, and Russia no longer stands alone at the top. While Dark Eagle may not yet match the raw power of Russian or Chinese systems, it changes the strategic equation. There are no proven air defenses capable of reliably stopping hypersonic missiles. That reality alone makes Dark Eagle a serious concern for America's rivals. Whether it becomes a true game-changer will depend on deployment, testing, and real-world performance. Until then, one thing is certain. The age of hypersonic warfare is no longer theoretical. It is here.